Hello, and welcome to Knitting the Notes with Dr. B. In this video, we'll explore the C-sharp minor scale and its three forms, along with its relative relationship to E major and its parallel relationship to C-sharp major. The E major scale is spelled E, F-sharp, G-sharp, A, B, C-sharp, D-sharp, E. The relative minor of every major scale begins on its sixth note. So if you go from the sixth note up an octave and back using only the notes of E major, you'll have the C sharp natural minor scale. If you raise the seventh note a half step, you'll have the C sharp harmonic minor scale. And if you raise the sixth and seventh notes a half step, you'll have the C sharp melodic minor scale. And every melodic minor scale is only melodic when it's going up. Coming down, you have to be natural because that's how composers use the, that scale. The parallel major of C sharp minor is C sharp major. And in C sharp major, every note is sharped. To get C sharp minor from C sharp major in the natural form, you would lower the third, sixth, and seventh notes a half step. To get harmonic minor, you would only lower the third and sixth notes a half step if you're coming from C sharp major. And to get C sharp melodic minor, you would just lower the third note a half step of the C sharp major scale, and the rest of it you'd play just as if it was C sharp major when you're ascending. Descending, you would come back down in a natural minor scale. And that's it for C sharp minor. Thank you for knitting the notes with Dr. B and the cat.